Welcome to the Eliza Studio Quick Starts. This video will cover an overview of the Effects Engine, a powerful tool that provides innovative controls and functions for modulating a source's behaviors. Each default template session comes with a set of eight pre-built effects that can be visualized on the Effects page. You can also navigate to this page with the keyboard shortcuts Command-6 on Mac and Control-6 on Windows. The eight pre-built effects are three LFOs, a randomizer, step sequencer, ellipse, repulsion, and snapper. The effects page can be broken down into four sections. The effects chain, effects presets, preview, and parameters. To assign an effect to a source, navigate to the Soundscape page. Select a source, and then click the Effects Assign button at the bottom left of the Soundscape. A floating Effects Assignment window will pop up that allows for assignment of any created effects to the selected source. For example, the initial LFO rotating in a full circle can be assigned to Source 1. Source 2 can be assigned with the same exact effect. In fact, multiple sources can have the same effect applied. That's not all, however. Multiple effects can be assigned to a single source. For example, we can apply a randomizer to source 1, or even add a distance randomizer to the other source. To view the effects controls, click the list icon in the effects assignment window. In the effects page here, we can see all of the effects occurring. We can simply add more effects with the Add New window or create new presets by changing the parameters and clicking Save as New. We can rename the effect to Bounce Fast. For more information on the effects engine, please refer to the detailed help file where all of the features and functions of the effects engine will be explained in detail. This has been the Eliza Studio Quick Start for the Effects Engine Overview.